Uh, a huge threat is the fact that it has a huge influence on us. If there is an element of excessiveness or overindulgence, those individuals who spend so much time uh, to social media increases the possibility of, 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 of having that feeling of being lonely. It would lead me into that feeling of anxiety and, and depression. Normally, anxiety is an emotion, eh? emotion. And there's also uh, the, the uh, uh, feeling of tension, uh, the worried thoughts, and there's also somehow accompanied by physical changes. You know, the blood pressure is also being affected, you know. Because, uh, you know, it begins with, uh, with appraising, it begins with seeing things, with interpretations, you know. So, uh, when you see someone, for example, in, in the Facebook, uh, your, your ex, and, and, and he is actually with another person and and, uh, and then you your mind <laughs> uh, begins to to interpret that thing you know <laughs> and a lot of thoughts coming into your mind to the point that you come to judge yourself that you're not beautiful at all etc that you are not worthy of the love of the other person that it really you know creates anxiety in you you know <laughs> because that makes me so depressed and anxious it keeps me from fully functioning properly. I guess when it comes to social activities, it's demotivating to do anything because you're anxious and conscious of whatever you do, so you can't really do anything because you overthink every step you make. I usually use social media halos araw-araw na since nung, lalo na nung nag-pandemic, and kasi blended learning then hindi may iwasan yung gumamit ng social media. So parang araw-araw, social media na talagang ginagamit. Probably around like a couple hours to a few hours each day. Just around two to five hours at least. Well, there are a lot of researches and study that would say, you know, the, the, uh, those individuals who spend so much time uh, to social media increases the possibility of, 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 of having that feeling of being lonely, you know, being uh, anxious. Well, uh, there are symptoms that you have to recognize, you know, meaning if, for example, the tolerance, you, know, you can no longer, you know, parang you don't uh, feel like you are, you are okay. Um, there's that, that term in psychology, anhedonia. You don't feel good, you don't feel pleasure at all, unless you would be seeing yourself, you know, using the social media. No? Uh, yung ganun ba? Uh, there's always be the, the, it has to be always be present. It has, I always have to be connected with another human being, you know. And, and being away, it would lead me into that feeling of anxiety and, and depression. Madalas na hawak ng siyam na taong gulang na si Jepo, hindi niya tunay na pangalan ang kanyang tablet. Ginagamit niya ito sa kanyang online classes maging sa pag-asa sa social media. Hanggang sa may mapansin na ang lola ng bata. Minsan nakakalimutan niya na lang kumain. Pag inaalok namin na kumain, busog pa daw siya. Tapos siguro kahit na iihi siya, pinipigilan niya. Nito lang hunyo nang dinala sa ospital si Jepo. Ilang beses na pala siya nagpipigil sa pag-ihi dahil sa paggamit ng gadget na kung minsan ay umaabot daw sa apat na ora. You say addictive behavior, no? When is the time that leads into addictive addiction in a way, no? So addiction, there is the element of, you know, repetitiveness, you know? In a way, parang um, uh, there is that, uh, you know, the, the learning theory uh, uh, by, um, what is that, by Ivan Pavlov or by, you know, no? Uh, even by Albert Bendura, and you know, in terms of l we learn things, you know, and the tendency also to to repeat things that are pleasurable. You know? So, pag nag enjoy ka, you, you see something, watch something, or talking to somebody else and and sharing things, and you feel so good, and uh, you would tend to repeat that behavior to the point that if you're not aware, then the tendency to, <laughs> to repeat it without even, you know, 
mindful of how long. <laughs> so it becomes part of the behavior. It becomes the part of your repertoire. A huge threat is the fact that it has a huge influence on us because media has a really huge impact on how we think and how we live. Nakapansin na rin ang mga magulang ni Nakisha ng ilang pagbabago sa kanyang pag-uugali. Naalarma sila, kaya't inagapan ng bunso. Kinukontrol nila ngayon ang paggamit ng anak sa mga gadget. Sa YouTube, napanood niya na yung tinatawag niya ng bad baby. Bad baby. Tapos, ginagaya niya yun. Yung nagtatapon ng pagkain. Kasi merong ganun na ano, yun yung problema nun. Tinatapon niya yung pagkain, ginagaya niya. Tapos, nang, nang pupukpuk. Ginagawa namin, ino offline namin yung ano. I guess because of the al algorithm that keeps you scrolling and keeps your eyes fixated on your screen, it does affect my sleeping patterns in a bad way because when you start scrolling through those platforms, it just never ends and you just find yourself in this loop where you can't stop yourself anymore. Anxiety and depression is very much actually in a way related. You know? So when, for example, uh, when there is that, it begins first with anxiety. You know? So that is the one that being triggered. And then uh, when that, like for example, if you tend to, you, know, you, you are no longer sleeping and getting adequate sleep, uh, and that leads into depression. You know? And uh, it could also be like that you feel so lost, you feel so alone and empty, those are actually signs that you are now having that depression in you and you are no longer be talking to somebody else. No? So. Too much social media sa iba ay nakaka-apekto na sa mental health nila, sa academic performance nila. Recently is that teenager who was actually referred to me by, by her parents because that teenager, I could not actually mention the name, is uh, in a way, uh, the parents discovered that they were, he was actually searching you know, and what was the theme, you know, what was the searching for ways how to kill parents without being noticed. Imagine that, you know, where did that idea came from. You know? So, it was alarming. You know? so, Ano pa? Like, like my daughter too at this point in time, ano? <laughs> my goodness, I, I, uh, especially during the pandemic, the, the height of the pandemic, uh, she was not actually attending classes, ano? So, uh, the online classes. She was actually in, in, in her chat, in her YouTube, in her social media, etc. Ano? And I, I, I always go to the school to intervene in a way and, and, and telling the teachers to give her another chance because she's not actually, she was not then submitting <laughs> the, how they call that, the assignments, the tasks. <laughs> That's it. So I, I, I need really to uh, monitor my, my, my daughter's uh, cell phone use, especially uh, her social media um, habit. Uh. Well, this is kind of graphic, but um, uh, well, before I used to hurt myself because uh, it the pressure and comparing myself to others made me want to just kill myself, and uh, <clears throat> I guess. Another way for me to cope is being able to spend time with the people who care, the people who are important, and the people I love. I hope there will be, because the problem, no, the problem when you say there is a problem, problems in in the social media, it is still very very much connected with with uh, family, you know. So I would suggest family bonding, uh, wherein uh, there would be a time that nobody using cell phone at all, but simply be uh, giving time to one another. 
what solutions do you suggest solving the evident problems brought about by social media? I hope people like you would really be more into this kind of thing, advocating you know, for uh, for protection, advocating for safety, advocating for um, um, securing the mental health of the young people in using the technology. You know, I then I hope young people will also be able to really to produce researches uh, that will really be uh, you know uh, enough for them to defend you know, that this particular just you know uh, using technology like. Like the, the the cell phone uh, are now is now very alarming, you know, because it really threatens the mental health of the of the users, you know, especially young people. You know. Para sa akin, sarili lang natin yung mga ng problem na yon, kasi tayo lang din naman ang gumagamit and tayo lang din naman ang nagshare sa social media, kaya. Dapat hawak din natin yung kung hanggang ano lang yung dapat natin ginagawa sa social media. With all the things happening from social media and media in general, it's important for us to remember uh, the people who really care about us and who do know us because, you know, like all the other people on social media are just people who don't really know us that well. and. Another thing is like we have to keep doing what we do and what we feel is right for us and what we love, not because it's something we see on social media. I hope parents will be able to really guide uh, their children properly. You know, uh, like. There was even a time that uh, in the past, TB becomes a technological babysitter. You know? So they can go to work, they will just put their kids there in front of TV and watching TV. But nowadays, it was the cell phone. I <laughs> just, okay, play games, hear the cell phone. And, and that's something that has to be, you know, uh, prevented. You know? Sana mas, ano, mas, uh, parents are much more conscious. You know? Uh, in doing that and, and value the importance of relationship. You know? So I hope there will be, because the problem, you know, the problem when you say there is a probl problems in, in the social media, it is still very, very much connected with, with uh, family. You know? So I would suggest family bonding, uh, wherein uh, there would be a time that nobody using cell phone at all, but simply be uh, giving time to one another. And, and that could be, in a way, copied by their children and, 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 and it would somehow instill in their mind the importance of relationship more than uh, uh, the time that they're going to spend in, 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 in the social media.